Hi, I'm Victor Komen. You may know me as the author of the Prometheus award-winning novels Solomon's Knife, The Jehovah Contract, and Kings of the High Frontier. But you may not know that I am also the archivist for the late great discoverer of counter-economics and the originator of agorism, Samuel Edward Konkin III, also known by his tetragram SEK3. Through Kopubko, I've published his books New Libertarian Manifesto and Agorist Primer and his final unfinished masterpiece, Counter-Economics, as well as making back issues of New Libertarian available. But there is so much more. While living in the Anarcho Village in Long Beach, something I'll tell you about in subsequent reports, I came into possession of much of Sam's stuff when he moved out. Then once more, when he moved out of the Anarcho Villa in Culver City, I was given leave to take more of his papers, in addition to a couple of geriatric Mac Power books and a spindle of data backup DVDs. All of these are a treasure trove of documents, emails, page maker uh, files, photographs that trace the development of Agora's theory, with lively exchanges between Sam and such luminaries of the libertarian movement as Wendy McElroy, Murray Rothbard, James J. Martin, Carl Hess, Neil Wilgus, Robert Anton Wilson, and many others. Sam died unexpectedly on this day, February 23, 2004, 17 years ago. For 17 years I've stored box upon box of his personal papers, calendars, notes, manuscripts, and magazines in the hope that someday I would be able to make them available. This GoFundMe project will digitize every existing issue of every incarnation of New Libertarian from 1970 through 1990 and beyond, consisting of an image and the actual text. This includes every magazine that he produced, every magazine that he appeared in, even if it wasn't his own, uh, every uh, letter to and from him that we have. Sam did keep carbons of letters that he sent out, and in later years he kept uh, you know, documents on disk, and that's what's on those backup disks, as well as his personal papers, letters, articles, in other publications, fanzines, notes, and calendars, and make them available on a single website to researchers, historians, entrepreneurs, activists, and just the plain curious. In addition, I possess the original videotapes and audio tapes from seminars that Sam conducted at the Agorist Institute in the 1980s, which need to be converted from VHS and audio cassette into lossless digital formats. The videos need to be cleaned up and the sound boosted. I want to do all this, but I can't do it on my own in my spare time as a hobby. That would take too long. Sam died 17 years ago. His friends and allies, J. Neil Shulman and Brad Lineweaver, died in 2019. New Libertarian contributors such as Murray Rothbard, Carl Hess, Robert Shea, Robert Anton Wilson, Chris Tame, Bill Patterson, Kerry Thornley, and Butler Schaefer are all gone. And I'm no spring chicken. So with the understanding that we have no enemy but time and the state, I want to make the Agorist Archives of Samuel Edward Konkin III a major project for 2021. This is the secret underground bunker in which the hard copy of the Agorist archives reside. It's not designed to withstand a nuclear blast, but the internet is. And that's why you and I need to get this vital history of libertarianism and agorism and counter-economics from the 70s through the millennium into digital format. That's where you come in. Your donation to the GoFundMe project to help save the Agorist archives of Samuel Edward Konkin III will allow me to devote the majority of my time to digitizing these fragile, sometimes 50-year-old documents and making sure that I can convert the video and the audio before the tapes become too brittle and fragile to be readable. I've tried to store everything as best I could, looking forward to the day when these documents could be made available to the world. With your help, that day is here.